Hello, I'm Don Fisher and I'm president of the Railroad Museum of Long Island. I want to welcome you today to the museum and give you an opportunity to meet some of our young volunteers, see the important work that they do, and hopefully encourage you to come down, become a member, and volunteer here at the Railroad Museum of Long Island during our season. Hi, my name is Jordan Torregrosa. I'm 15 years old. I volunteered at the Railroad Museum of Long Island for about a year now. I came about here when I was probably about eight years old my first time and noticing specifically the gift shop train layout, I kind of got interested especially in like the moving parts of the model trains and that's what drew my attention to this wonderful place that you see here. I mostly work around the model train layouts. I'm a handyman here and there, so I'll help out a lot of other people. Um, the main thing I do, obviously, is the model trains. And usually you'll run them for people, try and fix them up, switch the trains out every time, and just see all the kids happy and enjoy it. Hi, I'm John Golden. I've been volunteering at the Rare Museum for about a year and a half now. Uh, I go to Shoreway River High School, and I'm 16 years old. I saw this locomotive right behind me, 399 and 1556, uh, which is the big uh, diesel locomotive to the back, to my back, and um, I was uh, and I and I was really impressed by what the museum had, and uh, I uh, went home and I searched up the museum and I found out I could volunteer here, and I joined as a member and I came out here on uh, I want to say uh, March 14th. I was was the first day I volunteered here. I met the president, Don Fisher, and uh, all the other volunteers. I was very impressed about the uh, facilities. Um, and the first uh, volunteering experience I had as working was actually uh, painting uh, a locomotive, which was the big diesel locomotive to my back, which was 1556. And uh, I think it's all uh, very cool. Well, my first experience, believe it or not, was in Greenport. My father brought me out every other Saturday just to visit. He asked if I wanted to become a member, and uh, he was my transportation. And I was like, yeah, this is where I wanted to be. I brought my HOs out to run on the layout, and uh, I was doing that every other weekend until we opened up the Riverhead site. My first time hearing about the G16 was in a Long Island Rail book called Steels of the Sunrise Trail by Ron Zeal. Uh, I was disappointed to hear that the World's Fair was closed at that time. But when I heard the Rare Museum of Long Island was requiring the G16, I knew that someday I was going to be an engineer. And I worked on the bottom and worked my way up. And uh, hard to believe that it's running still. It's going to be 50 years old in 2014. And as a member, a dedicated member, I created a Facebook page for the G16, uh, which you could find through the Rare Museum of Long Island's Facebook page. Basically, it's photos, artifacts about the G16, um, photos by guests who come with their families and they take pictures and they post it so other people across the country can. A piece of Alan Gershaw Company's products is still running. It's just, uh, it's just amazing. Hi, my name is Matt Marantato. I'm 14 years old and I live in Patchogue and I've been an active member of the museum for about two or three years. Well, railroading has also been a large, large part of my life due to the fact that my family usually worked a lot on the railroads. So I thought maybe this would be a good start in my career of working on the railroads. It also interests me because I would get help start my education on railroad technologies and history. Not only that, you learn perfect wiring, carpentry, scenery, artists, uh, art. Working on a railroad is a very fun experience. You get to do things you never thought you could think you'd do. Repair a locomotive, run a locomotive, repair anything. Tracks, cars, locomotives. And we're not just a bunch of guys you know that you just, oh, hi, how you doing? We're like a family. We're one big and crazy family. We like to have fun, we, but we like to get our work done especially. But the most important thing is that we have fun while we do our work. Hi, my name's Evan. Uh, I've been working for the Rare Museum for about a year and a half now. I go to the Shore and River High School and I am 15 years old. So, uh, 
John told me that he was volunteering here at the Rare Museum of Long Island and said it was a very fun place. He was enjoying himself here. So uh, he told me to come down one day and check it out. So I came down and I enjoyed it myself. So I decided to become a member and uh, volunteer. Uh, when I'm here, I like to work in the gift shop and sort of like the business end of, I like working with the customers and uh, you know, seeing new faces here every so often and uh, seeing some of the same faces sometimes. I've had the opportunities to work with the merchandise around the gift shop and I've had the opportunities to rearrange it and uh, sort of make it easier for people to find the merchandise here. I've had opportunities to learn with the cash register as well as to learn with uh, the customers, how to work with customers, as well as running a shop. So, not only do we have working on trains and stuff out in the yard, we also have working in the garden, possibly maintaining the garden, and we also have library work here on Tuesdays to work on. Hey guys, my name is Joe Costa and I've been a volunteer here at the Railroad Museum of Long Island for six years. Well, years ago before I became a volunteer, I, uh, I used to come up here for like three days when I'm not doing anything. I come up here with my father and the first thing that caught my eye was uh, the G16 which I'm sitting in right now going around the yard and engine 39 across the street and and I'm a big steam fan. I've been I've been liking trains since I was four years old and uh, so one day I came up to the museum and I asked my father and I say hey maybe one day we could uh, come up and volunteer every other Saturday so so that's how I got started volunteering here over the six years that I've been volunteering here you know it's been like a really awesome experience for me and and through it all you know working on the G16 on on the engines number one you know I could basically say that if you want if say your dream job you want to work on the railroad I mean I mean this is the place to be you know to get that experience. Thank you for being with us today, and thank you for spending some time to visit and see the work of our young volunteers here at the Railroad Museum of Long Island. After seeing this video, if you too would like to join us and help at the Railroad Museum, please contact us at info at rmli.us for information on how you too can become a member and volunteer. Also, learn much more about the Railroad Museum of Long Island at our website, www.rmli.org.